What's up guys, Christian here. Today we're gonna go over my top five favorite UAD Luna tips and tricks that everybody should know. Counting down, starting at number five, creating custom third-party plugin icons. Super simple, just load up your favorite third-party plugin. Come over here to the drop-down menu, go to create plugin icon, boom, you have a new custom icon for your third-party plugin. Number four, adding an alternate monitor setup. Come up here into Luna Preferences, Hardware, Alt Count. If you have an Apollo Twin, you can have one pair of alternate monitors. If you have a rack mount unit, you can have up to two alternate monitor setups. And this allows you to switch between your mains and your alt monitors uh, with your hardware using the alt button, or you can do it from inside Luna with this button here. Number three, setting up multiple tracks and cascading inputs. Okay, let's say we have a drum kit mic'd and we want to quickly create tracks and cascade the inputs for all the mics on the kit. Create a new track. Let's say we have six tracks, call it drums. Click OK, boom, we've got our drum tracks here. Now we're gonna click on the first input on the first track. Go here where it says routing and click cascade and then assign the first input by clicking on it. And boom, you'll see it cascaded all of the inputs for my tracks automatically. Number two on the list, tempo mapping. This is really good if you um, have a live jam that wasn't performed to a click, or if you just want to find out the BPM of a track. I got a track loaded up here. You just got to determine where the second bar starts on the, on the track. On this track, I determined that it starts right here. So I'm just gonna hit Option, Command, I, and I'm gonna tell Luna that, that, that that's where the second bar starts. Click OK, and you'll see right here, it added a little tempo marker. And so now if I play it, you'll see it's to the beat now. And last, but definitely not least, my number one favorite trick in Luna, group editing insert effects. OK, I got my drum tracks loaded here from my previous example. I have them all selected. Create group, call this drums. Make sure you have insert selected here. Click OK, insert. Let's Add a Pro Q3 and just gonna do a little low cut on all these drum tracks. Cut out everything below 50 hertz and you'll see the low cut I made is applied to every track. And since they're grouped, any change you make to one will be made to all of them. And that's it. That's uh, my top five uh, tips and tricks for UAD Luna. I hope you enjoyed this video uh, and got something out of it. In the comments, let me know your favorite tips and tricks. Yeah, like, uh, share this video if you want and uh, I'll see you next time. Aloha.